welcome back. If you're new here, hi, my name is Crystal. I do fashion and lifestyle videos several times a week and I'm really glad that you're here joining me today. So today's video is a little bit different. Now bear with me. I was talking to you guys on Instagram Live, which by the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, um, it's, this is my handle, sometimes I am. Um, I go live two to three times a week and do live makeup tutorials. It's really fun. Um, but also it's a really good chance to like talk to you guys, get to know you, and you guys get to know me and you can basically ask me anything. And I was talking about the fact that I'm not doing a lot of lookbooks because it's so hot here in Phoenix. Every time I step outside, I'm literally just like gushing sweat. It's just, absolutely disgusting. So I said, do you guys mind if I do styling videos and stuff here in the office um, on the white background? So at least we're still like showing you styling stuff, but um, I just can't do it outside because it look disgusting. And a lot of you guys were like, cool, just make, yeah, just make the video, I don't care. So this is my first attempt. So you have to let me know what you think down in the comments down below. Oh, and before I get started, hit subscribe um, so you don't miss anything and hit the little bell because I'm still hearing that notifications are, are the only way you guys are getting alerted that there's new videos. So don't forget to hit the bell. Um, okay. so. Today's video is about sassy sarongs is what I'm calling it. So I have three here. If you don't know what a sarong is, a lot of people don't. Um, it's basically a big old scarf. Um, so it's something that you wear like over your swimsuit basically. So this is a kind of a like level up your beachwear kind of lookbook style video or something. So a sarong can be anything. You can purchase something that is specifically called a sarong. If you have a very large scarf that you like to wear, you can wear that as a sarong. Um, you really can do anything you want. So let me show you the three sarongs we're going to be styling. The first one, as I was the one I was holding up, um, is this blue, beautiful blue peony and white background one from Swimsuits for All. Um, they are linked down below, and I'll also link some other ones that I think are just really pretty. These are just the ones I happen to have with me. Um, this is so, so pretty. I love, I love this. I think that the um, blue and white print makes it look really Grecian and very feminine and very girly, so that's the first one. The second one is also from Swimsuits for All. This is a little more attitude, a little more, you know, a little more vibesy, as it were. Um, we have a black and white window pane, like kind of a graph paper background, and then these are not marijuanas; they're palm trees. So these are the, it's the palm tree print, because y'all know, y'all know how I get sensitive about accidentally buying marijuana prints. This is not a marijuana print; it is the palm print. Um, so it's really, really pretty. I feel like this is where this is very girly. I feel like there's a little more edge to the sarong. There's a little more attitude in the sarong. So I really like that. And then the last one I got from Dia and Co. The brand is Printed Village. I don't know what that is, um, but it is a pink background with uh, palm print on that as well. Very feminine, more more like traditionally tropical, that kind of thing. Um, I, so where can you get sarongs? You can get sarongs basically anywhere. I go to Target. What I like to do is go to Target and I will look in their scarf section. I'll look for something at the very light weight and I'll take it off and I'll be like, as, if it is longer than my arms are long and it is like, you know, this way, like it's, it's super longer than me. If it's taller than I am, it's golden. So I've worn, um, I have like an American flag scarf that I've worn as a sarong. I have star prints, I have every, all kind of things. So if you wear it as a scarf, you can probably wear it as a sarong. So in the lookbook styling portion of the video, I'm showing you seven different ways that you can wear these to like next level your swimsuit game. So I show you some around the hips. I show you like how to turn this into basically a kimono, turn, to teach you how to turn into a dress, and then teach you some really fun ways to put it in your hair so that you guys can really just do something really different. Now, one thing um, that I do wanna say is I started with a white bikini as a Face because we're working with prints. If you have a sarong or if you have a, um, a scarf that is a solid color, feel free to wear whatever swimsuit you want with it. But I thought starting with a white base would really allow us to see the print and put the focus on the print, if that makes sense. Um, so if you have tropical print swimsuits and you have like a black sarong, you're, you're good to go. You have a white sarong, pink, whatever. Do what you want. Find one that you love. Pair it with your favorite swimsuit and have fun. So I'm going to roll the styling portion.
styling portion. Let me know what your favorite version was down in the comments below. I really like the idea of wearing this as a bandana. I really like this weight in particular, by the way, over these ones. These ones are very, they're not heavy, but they're heavier and they're more of like a polyester opaque. This is definitely like see-through, like really airy and light. So I think this just lays better on the head when you're doing um, it as a bandana. I also love this trick for when my hair is like completely unruly and like I get out, like if my natural curl is out and I'm like, oh my God, my hair looks a dang mess and I need to go like go get drinks or something or we need to go get lunch. Putting this on as a bandana is hella cute, like hella cute. Um, and I hope you guys like the way to sh I showed you how to like make it into a dress, like a one shoulder dress, a strapless dress, a couple of kimono styles, um, and then your traditional classic just tie around the waist. So that is it for me, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's kind of short and sweet, but um, you know, we're trying out something new, so definitely please leave me some feedback down in the comments below so I know what you think. And if you like them, then I'll keep doing them at least until the weather gets better and I can go back outside into the world and do my Sunday slays again, which I'm really excited for. So yeah. Oh, and don't forget to let me know what your favorite sarong was in the comments down below. So that is it. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I love you so much. I'll see you next time. Bye. Okay guys, so if you are still living your best suns out, buns out life, check out my most recent swimsuits for all haul, which is where these guys are from. And then check out this lookbook that we shot in Malibu. Uh, it was about a couple months ago and it's still one of my favorite videos ever. So swimsuits, lookbook, subscribe, bye.